Welcome to our top secret March progress report. This month has really been kind of a turning point for us in a lot of ways, and it really sets us up for the next few months. I honestly think April may very well be the most important one in our entire JCC journey. So we're halfway through our timeline here before we do our first success checkpoint. At the end of June, we're going to take a long, hard look at everything we've done so far and see if we're really ready to proceed with Generation 1. So how have we been doing? This month, we had a number of really exciting things happen. Uh, I became a YouTube partner and opened up memberships. This is something I've been working super hard every day since my debut, and I'm so proud I managed to hit it in just three months. I'm also staggered by how many of you became members in less than a week. Seriously, thank you. We've also noticed that the fans that like us, like us a lot. They show up for a lot of our streams, they interact with us on multiple platforms, and they even catch all of the secret streams. I've always said getting a core group of dedicated fans is so important on the journey to becoming a successful content creator or a streamer. So on behalf of the JCC, I want to thank all of you who support us at every opportunity. However, March was honestly a rough month for us. Our growth stagnated on social media platforms, our stream numbers have dropped back down from the highs of February, and our Discord has slowed down in both new visitors and conversations. So why has this happened? So I have a few theories. One, it was made clear that a lot of people were going through exams in March. I ran a Twitter poll and shockingly, 33% of respondents were too busy with exams to watch as many streams as they would have liked. I guess I'm too much of a boomer to remember when exams are, but that does help explain why there was less traffic on our streams. Uh, number two, I don't know if you've noticed, but there are a lot more EN VTubers out there now. Many of them have debuted at this point and are starting to stream, so on most nights I see at least 30 to 40 VTubers streaming on Twitch. I don't even really follow that many people. So a lot of my EN VTuber fans are understandably streaming. I ran a poll that asks people what determines the stream they go and watch, and the majority of people say they watch their friends first really not surprising, and so that means that now that there are so many ENV tubers, everyone has their attention split between the friends and all this other competition, so it makes sense that less people are coming to watch us. Finally, with more people getting vaccinated and places opening up again, some VTuber fans might just be going out in the evenings instead of watching streams. I haven't done any testing to prove this, but it definitely sounds plausible. At the end of the day, I'm not going to make any excuses. Regardless of the reasons, we just have to do better. If there's any chance of JCC Gen 1 being a thing, we're going to need to work twice as hard in April to try and make up for March. I'm, I'm sorry if this news disappoints anyone who had higher hopes in us, but trust me, we're the most frustrated out of anyone here. But hey, this isn't a pity party. This is a company meeting. We have to hold our chins up and keep pushing through it. So let's talk about what we're going to try and do in April to turn things around. So for myself, I want to work on making more videos instead of streams. There's just so many streamers these days competing for your attention. I think maybe I can sidestep this by making more videos that you enjoy. Um, so that way I don't have to fight for the prime time slot with 15 to 20 to 30 other VTubers. I'll also be working together with Booster and the new JCC mod Numbers to help clean up our Discord to make it more user friendly. There's a lot of people in our Discord, but only a small handful of active participants. So we want to streamline this process a bit and hopefully bring a couple of you lurkers back into the fold. If you've been lurking and you're still interested in the JCC or in us, then please say something. You don't have a talk all the time, but I just love to hear from you. Finally, I want to focus on making more shorts. Trying to make shorts with Windows Movie Maker is so incredibly agonizing, so I'm going to try and teach myself Adobe Premiere to speed things up. I'm kind of a boomer though, so I learn new technology really slowly. Uh, hopefully I'll be able to pick things up soon and you'll be able to see more shorts from me. For Ellie and Booster, Ellie is also going to try experimenting more with her artistic side with possible art streams. She might also join me in learning some video editing too, instead of both of us just making Booster do all of it. Booster is going to work on making more regular YouTube content. Uh, we saw missile posting, we saw glob posting, we even saw Coco missile posting. So we've learned something quite interesting, and that's all of our random Twitch streams do way better than our YouTube streams. 
I uh, ran a poll a while back that showed the majority of my followers would rather watch streamers on Twitch than instead of YouTube. So Ellie and Booster are going to experiment with some regular Twitch streams every now and then to catch more of the audience there. So let's talk about some of the most exciting things to come out this month, starting with myself, Yusagi. Now that I have an actual capture card, I will be streaming some Mario Maker 2. I've never played it before, but seeing as how many of you love Boshi and I want to be the guy, I feel like anything that involves me going through endless suffering is kind of a safe bet when it comes to streams. Speaking of endless suffering, I'll be doing that alien isolation stream with Bunny as a reward for hitting monetization. I really regret making that promise, but we're going to do it. Finally, I'm going to start dipping my toes into the members only streams. If you're a star performer or a true fan, I've invited you to give me your Switch friend code so we can play Mario Kart together. There's still time to join if you want to play with me uh, for our first members only stream. For Ellie and Booster, our little ghost pal is planning something special with Blade and Sorcery this month. Not much I can say about this yet, but look forward to it. He's also going to be doing a no swearing Fall Guy stream, which is going to be really, really entertaining. Apparently he swears a lot when he plays Fall Guys. I think he might get a little bit frustrated. Ellie will be starting a very special Animal Crossing series. This Animal Crossing stream is going to be different from any other Animal Crossing stream you've ever seen on the internet. I am not exaggerating. I don't exaggerate. It'll be hopefully sometime this month, but we have to do a lot of setup into it. I promise you, you will not be disappointed. Finally, we're opening applications to the JCC Backseat Desert Bus. You can find the application form in the video description below. Ever want to just sit in a bus with the JCC and talk nonsense for two to three hours? Of course you do. We'll be doing this every couple weeks or so. So on top of our streams, we're also announcing something very special for this month. Artist Appreciation April. From now on, any art drawn of Ellie, Booster, or myself using the hashtag JCC art tag, we will retweet it and highlight it in our streams. But that's not all we're planning on doing. The three of us want to personally commission Twitter artists for more art. The artist community has really supported us so much these last few months, and we really want to give back in a real, tangible way. I'll be doing at least one Call for Artists threads on Twitter soon, so if you're interested, please participate and keep your DMs open. We will reach out to a select few artists to request commissions. Uh, hopefully we'll get as many of them as we can realistically afford as JCC. So that's it for our monthly status update. I have to be honest with you, this wasn't easy to put together. It's hard seeing the growth slow down, and it's even harder watching your numbers slowly dwindle, but I don't blame anyone. I honestly, I, I don't, I don't. If people are losing interest in us, that just means we weren't interesting enough. Thank you to everyone who sticked around and showed us such support in March, and I promise we're gonna bounce right back in April. Thank you for watching. Jisagi out.